Everything you said, they already knew, more or less. Well, here's something that you didn't know. Two of those special atomic bombs haven't gone off. Good morning, Chuck here in Bangkok, Thailand. Paige, we are uh, still here at the BS <laughs> BS Hotel in Bangkok. This bed here, if you guys are wanting to find a soft bed in Thailand, we've been to many, many places. Uh, this is the softest bed I think we have ever slept on. It was so soft, it was uncomfortable. Look, I mean, that is not something you're gonna see in thailand <laughs> but we got to uh leave the hotel at about 11 today to go to the airport uh from there we're going to taipei and two hour layover in taipei and then we're headed to the long flight to america but uh we're gonna go eat some breakfast this morning go check out the little market i'm bringing you guys along for the day uh you can see uh what it takes to go uh travel around a little bit in thailand and head back to the states so it's going to be a fun trip, guys, I promise. I hope you stay with us, and yeah, the fun continues. B.S. Okay, we're going to get some joke. Rice soup. That's good looking soup, huh? Cool, I've never seen that done. That's what it'll look like when it's finished. Well, that was good. Breakfast, uh, 50 bucks. It's like a dollar, dollar 50. Okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna buy a mask for the plane. We always wear the mask because when you sleep, you end up having your, uh, your mouth open, you know. So it's just easier to wear that on the plane. But look, they have a uh, <laughs> mango steen mask, mankut. I've never seen that. They have a lot of like cooling masks too. No, that's that. Not cooling. Sticker. Oh, never mind. It's like. I don't know if you've ever seen it in Thailand, but they like to wear these little stickers all over their head. It's, it's like a little cooling sticker for overheated. Probably works. I've never tried it. This looks stupid. Oh, Paige needs something for her back. I'm going to bring some coffee. I, I, I used to always drink my coffee black, but now I'm a addicted to that three-in-one coffee with cream sugar and uh co uh, and coffee it's easy it's really easy it's just a, all you need is hot water so we're going to be doing some traveling in the u.s so i'm just going to bring some of that i like that easy <laughs> Paige is uh, trying out her new uh, patch. But she, <laughs> what did you do? She says, it's not heating up, it's not working. She goes, oh, I did it wrong. What did you do? You put on your back? Let me see. I did the sticker. <laughs> oh, that's the, st she put the sticker on her back. Yeah. <laughs> it's not the actual heating pad? No. I guess the sticker's not hot? <laughs> okay, we're gonna go walk outside to the market and then uh, buy a couple more t shirts and get ready for the. Sh they have a shuttle bus here 
that takes you directly to the airport. And they will pick you up from the airport and bring you here too, which they have many hotels uh, here uh, that offer that service. Okay, we found some cool, got some these little Thai style pants for my mom. Meh, meh to Yentabai. Got a bunch for the kids, my grandkids. Okay, off to the airport, shuttle bus from the hotel. Free of charge, just need a tip. Okay, this is a, this is what I was talking to you about traveling in these vans, how it used to be very dangerous uh, because they drive too fast because I got to get to pick up more customers. But that little thing right there on the dash is going beep, 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 beep. That's GPS, GPS. So if he goes uh, over 90 kilometers per hour, it beeps steady, beep, and uh, he has to slow it down. So that's what I was trying to tell you, uh, describe to you on a previous uh, Q&A video. So that's it, beep, 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 beep. That's annoying by itself, but at least you don't have to worry about passing out from fear of death. <laughs> Warning. He don't know how much, but um, he didn't have so many. Uh, he can take a nice yeah, if he goes, not only does it beep, but if he goes over, they report it him every time he does over 90. And if he goes, uh, he hasn't done it yet, so he doesn't know how much the fine is. But if you do it uh, one too many times, they take your taxi license away from you. So there you go. Yeah. Right now, only these vans, uh, unless it's a private van, but uh, anybody who has a taxi license has to have that by law now in Thailand. And the taxis are coming soon. So they've already uh, made the two-story uh, buses obsolete after they have a 10-year period. I think they got eight more years left. And then uh, this, for the vans and then more safety features coming for the uh, taxi. So Thailand is really cracking down on uh, safety in Thailand, which is good for us, right? Hey, said her hot patches kicked in. Feeling good? <laughs> they go from being cold to itchy to warm and feeling good. Welcome. Airport shuttle buses. Will they take you anywhere else? No. no they take you between the two airports uh, for connecting flights. So if you were coming into Thailand, into Bangkok, and let's say you wanted to go to Phuket, no, not Phuket, let's, let's say like you wanted to go to uh, uh, Udon. You come here and you can get on the bus to the domestic Dong Muang airport and then they take you to Chiang Mai or anything like that. But uh, yeah, easy. Each airport. But it is organized, yeah. Hello, so what do you have? Fan club. Uh huh. Fan club. Fan club. Hello. Chelai hop. Uh, what's your name? My name is Silikan. Silikan? Uh, oh, okay. Cool. <laughs> That's funny. She's going to Australia. How long? Giwan. Giwan. Samwan. Samduan. Samduan. She's going for three months. So, okay. Thank you. See you later. Bye bye. <laughs> Okay. We're really early. So I don't even know if they're open. Open yet. 
Okay, we gotta wait an hour before we can check in. So, it's okay. We are, every time we travel, we don't like being transients. But every time we do travel, we're always super, super early at the airports. Uh, to, to us, we'd rather just sit and chill out and wait. Back home, we sit at the bar, have a couple drinks. I missed. Oh yeah, one time <laughs> we missed the plane one time. That was probably my fault. No, it was a crappy airline. It was uh, were we flying? No, never mind. We were flying United. Anyway, uh, it's funny. I'm gonna tell you guys when I see subscribers that see us. It's more of a shock to me than than to them. All right, you know I can't. It's funny that you're recognized uh, now. So, but I mean, people in the airport, of course, is most most of the people that watch my channel are coming in and out of Thailand. So this would be the place to see to see people. Anyway, it's funny. Family Mart. So we're just gonna walk around, check it out. Maybe one day I'll run into somebody that doesn't like my channel. We've had a few words on the internet. That would be entertaining. Bet you they wouldn't come up and talk to me though. So this is all your domestic area on the back side of the airport. The inside here, you can get this at every corner, every couple of steps, there's money exchange. I know everybody's going to say the exchange rate is horrible in the airport. I get it. Fine. Uh, it's not really that much, but you can come here and get a little bit of cash uh, ex currency exchanged here. Either way, you definitely want to get some cash. Uh, I would draw out 10,000 baht, which is about 300 US dollars, depending on where you come from, because nobody takes uh, credit cards outside of like the hotels and stuff like that. So you need to have some cash. So in the back of the airport, like I was telling you guys on the last Q&A that a viewer had asked about the BAT. Here's where you come to get a refund here for tourists. Like I said, you have to be uh, leaving Thailand within 30 days. Has to be, I think it's over a couple thousand baht. I gave an example of 5,000, but I think it's 2,000 baht and the merchandise has to be leaving with you. But anyway, uh, I think it also depends on a type of item too. But anyway, you can come here and have it inspected, have all your receipts and everything. Gotta go get your stamp first at customs. Also here in the back, there's a uh, post office, which is easy to use. And uh, I guess it would be good like if you had something, think, something that you didn't want to bring on the plane uh, or something you couldn't bring on the plane, mm -hmm. uh, you could mail it. Or maybe you have too much stuff. I don't know, but you could mail it. You could just mail it. Yeah. I'm glad I didn't bring my hand grenades. Got our tickets. We're gonna go upstairs, get settled in, checked in our luggage. Easy. Oh, we gotta go through customs. No, we gotta go through uh, the security, right? Yeah, I gotta go through security. Checked in. Get your little uh, stamp. This is where you come upstairs to get your money. <laughs> if you're lost, you uh, scan your your boarding pass and it tells you where to go. It gives you a map. Cool. This is a huge, gigantic airport. Smells really good. Home. Smells good. 
Um, <laughs> I may have to get a piece of that. There it is. It tastes like Papa Chuck's pizza. No. Better. It's okay. Okay. It smelled really good. 50 bucks. Two pieces of pizza. It was pretty good, I thought. I thought it was decent. I ate that big piece and half a hurt. So. Mm -hmm. Gonna buy some durian for the plane. Oh, look, mango and sticky rice. <laughs> there are so many places to eat in here, and I'm full. And that's Burger King. Well, here's to an awesome trip. Leo, our last Leo. Seemed like there's only one place that sold Leo in the airport. Yeah, <laughs> I figured I would drink a beer, maybe relax on the plane. It's only a two and a half, three hour flight to Taipei. We got our pillows. I got some pretty ones here. This stuff right here, if you come to Thailand, it's, I know you guys, I don't know if you've seen people putting that in their nose. nose. It's like a, uh, a, uh, it's a, it's a nose inhaler and it helps clear your sinuses. It's good if you're getting overheated, um, stuff like that. But Thai people like that a lot. But if you open the other side, you can get the liquid. And if you put a dab on your arms and your neck, mosquitoes, flies, gnats, they hate that stuff. So it's a good repellent. You want one? I'm gonna get one. <laughs> How am I? Boy. Long. Long. Yeah, later on. This place is huge. What is that? It's over there, I think. We don't know where we're at. Awesome. Eva. Okay. Right here? Is this ours? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Sucks. Okay, we're here, Eva. It's not too bad. There's a lot of leg room here. The bed looks better, but it's, a, it's only a little under a three hour flight, so. Uh -oh. Selfie. Anyway. There we go. I've never been on a plane. When I say never, I don't remember that when you get up, you don't bust your head. Look how high that thing goes all the way up there. <coughs> Okay, we're here, Taiwan, Taipei Airport. Flight was easy, a little bit of a little bit of a delay, but it's okay. I think we still have another hour and a half. Only 30 minute delay. So we're in Taipei Airport and I just ran into this crazy person right here. Hey, hey, Hi. What's, your, what's your name? Ronnie. 
Brani. 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 Oh, Brani. 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 Sorry, ha. Oh wait, where are my dogs? <laughs> We're checking selfies. We gotta do selfies. Oh wait, I can't see them. I love it. Oh, oh my cool, God. fun, fun, fun. Yeah. yeah. Where are you? You're going? How long are you staying in Bangkok? I'm staying for a month. Oh okay. Um, Grandchildren. And you're coming from LA. LA. Oh. From LA. This is my, I don't know. He's on your okay, page. Okay, cool. So I don't know. Okay, fun, fun, fun. So when we come back here, we're going to spend uh, 14 hours. Yeah. We don't need to get a visa, do we? Yeah. Just can say, hey, we're here. We want to check you out and run around. Okay. <laughs> Asia is so strange, isn't it? Okay, just lay an egg. Right. Man, I don't know if I can sit on it. I can get down, I don't know if I can get back up. Oh, wait. We got an hour to kill. It's walking around. You want a soda? I don't know how much it cost. So I have no idea. $25. I don't know. $20. I have no idea. I uh, went to this little, I found a, another GoPro battery. I needed another battery. I bought one, actually Paige got me one on Lazada. Um, it's not a uh, official GoPro, but it, usually the cheap batteries last, but this one won't charge up to like 60%. So anyway, I got this one for $31. So I got to, I used US currency, he gave me a, he gave me U.S. currency change back, but he gave me twenty dollars in uh, Thai or no, in Taiwanese money. I said, "What can we do with that?" Because you can buy a water, so we're gonna buy a water. Actually, you can get a soda. They have lemon lime. So much fun. Let's see. <laughs> What is, I mean, I like to get something strange, but I don't know what it says. What is that? That looks weird. That looks like the honey white um, melon. Let's get that. The melon? Honey white melon. Wait, it says, okay, do it. <laughs> you try it first. Wow. That's a strange tasting tea. Hey, do you want to go? How much more time do we have? Let's go walk. Paige. She's got a random uh, search. She gets to go behind the magic curtain. I usually am the one that gets that. So how was your pat down experience? <laughs> Tika. <laughs> <laughs> Did you feel violated at any time? No. Was it fun? Really? You want to do it again? Really? <laughs> <laughs> can, you, can you do a little, a little bit on this side? Can you tell me your back end? Did you finish scratch? I'm 
always the one that gets the strip search. No, look at the bag. Oh. <laughs> okay, we're here. We made it. Eva Airlines. This is our next home for the next 16 hours. So anyway, guys, thank you for coming with us. Got a long ride home. I'll see you when we get to Houston. We got, we got a little crying baby who just pooped in his pants behind us. So we got that going for us. 